This is my beginner's tutorial for AGSub version 1.10. Tip of day will come up. This is your default layout when it comes up every time. Uh, first thing I personally usually do is uh, open a video. <clears throat> the video I'm working on at the moment is What Can I by Cute. Uh, this video won't play properly as I'm currently recording the screen, so it won't play as well as it should. It's a bit laggy. So we'll just ignore that for now. Uh, you might want to reduce that to whatever's a comfortable size for your monitor. That's where you put in all the text. This area just here. Hit enter. Or if you don't want to go to the next line, if you want to make some adjustments. And don't want to go to the next line, hit control enter and it changes. You can see it just there. Changing. Uh, we can get rid of that. Next thing you'll want to do if you're timing a promotional video like I will be is open audio from video. This is just how I personally do things. You might get to like the program a different way and do things differently to what I do. It's all a personal choice, really. Right. Then you'll want to open the subtitles, which I got from projecthello.com. And where did I save them? I personally save three separate files. Some um, one group I work with has all thing in the ones of each line is a line of kanji, a line of romaji, and a line of English. But that's just how they do things. Save before continuing. No. No. Uh, right now, because that was a text file, everything if you look here with the mouse, everything is coming up at zero. And I'll actually delete that line there. You can do stuff by right clicking or we get to keyboard shortcuts later. Now, the first thing you want to do is line up all of each line so they're playing at the right time in the song. And up here you've got basically where the wave storm wave storm where the waveform starts peaking like that is where you'll want to... that's basically where the music kicks in. Probably watching the video a few times over will help you get an idea for... and I'm going to have to turn my speakers down. Now, that, this area of white here that goes, as you can see from the numbers, goes from 20 seconds 0.55 to 25 seconds 0.05 will affect the currently highlighted line, which in this case is this line. Highlighted line is that sort of green colour. I ignore those purple lines, they're just where there was a gap in the text file. <coughs> uh, hit space. Oh. Get out of there, click up here again, hit spacebar. I'm going to unplug my headphones, but keep... That's just too loud.
Right now that line there is Wakanai's air. So we want to. Obviously that goes over into the second line and at the moment we just want what can I say. So that's about this slider here stretches that out so you can see more accurately the waveform or pushes it in. Uh, if you want to go to the part of the song just double click on that and we'll take that'll take the video there and clicking on that will take the audio stream there. So again, uh, D or spacebar. Make sure this is area is selected. You don't want to be down here or you'll be typing D in space. Select here. Uh, the Z to me seems to finish about there. Zoom that in. Okay, that seems good to me. So we'll hit enter and go to the next line. That part becomes faded. Then just uh, grab a bunch from wherever to wherever and hit space. See that finished on Matsuni. We want Nachata Hatsukoi as well. So that wants to go out a fair, fair way there. Bring this back a bit. Uh, also, now they're overlapping. That that's fixed. We can come here. This way it changes your numbers. That starts at 2202. So we want this to finish at 2202. Enter.